you know, from 2016 to 2018, I had the honor and privilege of co-chairing the Yes on Three campaign in Massachusetts, which was the first statewide vote on transgender rights in our nation's history. And the stakes could not have been higher, uh, both for me as a transgender man, uh, feeling the personal impact of it, somebody with deep roots in Massachusetts, but also for our movement. Part of the opportunity I had as the co-chair of that campaign was to see the love and courage that really powered that campaign on the ground to a landslide victory, 68 to 32 percent. I mean, it wasn't even close in the end, although it was a fight all the way to the finish. Parents standing up for their children, people of faith standing up for transgender people, not just in spite of their faith, but honestly because of their faith, business leaders standing up for their workers. People are with us. We just have to give them the opportunity to be with us. We are winning right now, and we will get protections nationwide over the line by 2025, I do believe that.